I'm proud that Forward ISD became the first school district in the state to honor Cesar Chavez and Dolores Huerta with a student holiday. So Dolores Huerta and I are both um, from Stockton, California. Growing up, I think we had a slightly different take on Dolores Huerta uh, because she was just a Stockton kid just like me. I've had the pleasure of meeting her several times and she is the most humble, kind, and sweet lady who believes in the power of education. The party was very fun, except for polio. We are participating in a reading marathon to honor the life and legacy of our namesake, Cesar Chavez, and also Dolores Huerta. I believe the idea for the reading marathon was uh, brought forth by a community member. I mean, if you develop an interest in books, you'll, you'll be able to go anywhere in the world, any, any time in the world, Education is the savior of our society. But Dolores Huerta was actually an elementary school teacher. She wants everybody to do well. She wants, she wants uh, the best for everybody. Um, and that's what we hope to do at Dolores Huerta Elementary. Once you learn to read, as Cesar Chavez said, they can never take that away from you. They knew the hard life you would have as a migrant worker, as a farm worker and the easiest way to get out is an education. And the sooner you learn how to read and comprehend, the further you can go. Everybody raised their hand. Everybody wanted to be the one uh, selected to read. Whatever they wanted to read, they were able to read in whatever language they felt more, co more comfortable with. I think this is the perfect link to honor their legacies and tie the importance of education to their fight. We're promoting the day of service uh, on their holiday. So I think it's wonderful to give back. It just makes you a better person, right? Learning about others, learning about others that may not have what you have, uh, that may not be able to do what you can do. So the day of service is meaningful in that Cesar Chavez and Dolores Huerta were proponents of doing whatever it takes to lift up a community. Incorporating service learning is so important to making sure that our students graduate as good citizens. Our students, um, many of them are bilingual and they're biliterate and they're very talented. They have a lot to offer this world and I'm excited to showcase that. That is um, maybe an untold story in the headlines. It just opens a new world that can never be taken away. Education, as we know, is a great equalizer. In order to succeed in life, we need to be uh, we need to be fluent, we need to be educated, and we also need to be good readers. The first grader came up to me and asked, what are you reading right now, Dr. Ramsey? Do you think the book might and I said, well, I'm reading two books. I'm reading something for work and I'm reading something for pleasure. And she pointed her finger up at me and she said, good, because if you're not reading, you're not learning. I have a new tagline. I think that's why the marathon is so important. If we can instill at a very early age the love of reading, our students are never going to stop learning. Se puede. Sí. 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 Sí.